Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do a reading for Aries. This is for Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, and this is for, you can say the next seven days, but the timing is fluid and not every reading is for you. So this reading may not be for you at all, so keep that in mind. What do we have for a message today? For Aries, ooh, four leaf cro clover. This is, says great, good fortune. So this is good luck, luck is on your side. Good fortune. Oh, ooh, mice. Discord among friends or family. So there you got some pests here. There could be some family discord, okay? You may have to clear some things up. Oh, here we go. Bull. Bull. Do not back down from opposition. Show strength and fortitude. So you're going to have to be strong. You're going to have to be steadfast. Uh, don't, don't give up your position, okay? You're probably fighting with somebody in your family or your friends, you know, in your circle. And they're going to poke you. They're going to try to take you down. You have to stand in your position, okay? Do not give up, okay? Don't back down. So what, oh, there we go. We got some of that. Flipped right over, right away. Mm. It's interesting, because that came out in Aries. Okay, perseverance, strength. Fight for what you believe in. You know, Aries is Mars energy. Be ready to fight. Don't give up. You're probably going to have to fight for whatever it is you believe in. You know, fight for your position. Some of you are dealing with an older woman. There could be an older woman that is working against you. Maybe you don't know it. Maybe, you, maybe you're aware of it and you're ignoring it. There is an older woman here that could be causing you some discord. I know that there is. I know that that's what this older woman is. There is some sort of angel protection here as well. So you have, you're protected. You are protected. So you're protected, Aries. Uh, I just happened to look on the bottom. I'm not sure if you are in an unrequited love situation. We got somebody here where there's a lack of reciprocation. or It's like one person loves the one, but the other doesn't, you know? So we, I feel like we do have an unrequited love situation here. We're going to go ahead and use this deck. What do we have? No, we're not. I don't want to use that deck. We're going to use this deck. We went back to my favorite deck because I don't know why. Anyhow, what do we what do we have for Aries? Because my intuition told me to. Maybe you need to listen to your intuition, follow your intuition, listen to your gut. What do we have for Aries for the week ahead? I guess I gotta take these. Ten of Pentacles. Ten of Pentacles about money. It's about abundance, business, family. Uh, financial success, that's probably what you're focusing on. You're probably fo focusing on money. Maybe have something to do with family money or something like that. But this is about your financial success. Because this is in your right, where you are right now. You know, you're working on your, your home or your business or your bank account or your stability. That's where you are right now. I wonder if there's something that is going down because what is challenging you is the Ace of Wands. It happens to be reversed. There may be a lack of growth or something is going downhill. Um, three of Wands reversed. World card. Ace of Swords. Six of Wands. You're going to be victorious. You're going to persevere. You're going you're gonna to be successful. Um, Six of Wands is in your future, so success is coming to you. You're going to win. If you're battling, you're going to win the battle. This is a win. So you will win. Four of Pentacles reversed. Hierophant reversed. Something about a commitment. Um, but the Hierophant reversed is like no commitment. Um, disbelief. We have somebody here that's having a hard time doing the right thing because of social pressure. 
there there could be you know somebody that's not very spiritual they don't believe in god they don't have a, they don't listen they don't listen to their gut it could be you i mean it could be you but you could also be dealing with somebody that is abusing their power um, this is somebody who's having a hard time doing the right thing due to social pressure. Now this may have something to do with a father that is not doing the right thing or somebody that's just abusing their power. They're under a lot of social pressure. Knight of Wands reversed in your future. Uh, reckless, out of control, angry. You could be dealing with a sibling or a friend or a family member that is angry, that is out of control, that is... This is kind of like a disgrace. There could be some, there, this is a disgrace with the hero font reverse. It's very embarrassing. There's some sort of embarrassment here. Um, I feel like you need to let go. You need to let go of something. Your your approach is the four of wands reversed is let, or four of pentacles reversed. I've been doing this a lot lately. I think we are going into Mercury retrograde, maybe Mercury retrograde shadow. I'm not sure, but anyhow, uh, in your approach is the four of pentacles reversed. Let go of, you need to let go of something that maybe it's something of financial value. Let go, let go of the need for the money. Don't go after the money. Something about the money because the four of pentacles is money. Just let it go. Just let it go. I mean, in your future is a six of wands. A six of wands is a battle. It's like letting go. It's stop fighting. You know, it's it's to win the battle. You may have to end the battle. Okay. You maybe you choose. Maybe you get an epiphany or an awakening. I mean, what's coming in is the Ace of Swords right above you, which is the truth. Okay, it's it's some sort of truth coming in out. Or truth coming in could be acceptance of the truth. Could be taking a new approach, getting a new idea. There's some sort of truth that is coming out. You may not be, you may not believe it when you hear it. This could be this could be a disbelief. This could definitely be a disgrace. It could be embarrassing whatever it is. There's this is like the the 3 of wands reversed is uh not being received well. So I'm wondering if you're you're doing something that is not being received very well. Three of Wands reverse. It's a lack of foresight. It's wasting your time on something. It feels like you. If you want peace and harmony, because the Six of Wands is about peace and harmony. It is after a battle. It's, the battle is over. Stop fighting. If you want peace and harmony, because the Six of Wands is the journey. It's a journey to balance and harmony. But you have to not. The battle needs to end. You need to stop fighting. You need to stop fighting. And, and if you and if you are under a lot of social pressure, I mean, that hero font is in your reading, okay? It's in reverse. If you're under a lot of social pressure, you know, to prove something, this is a disgrace. You're only going to cause yourself more stress. I feel like you will win if you stop playing these games or you stop fighting because that's what the six of wands is it's the end of a battle it's the end of a conflict that's in your future this is like something coming to an end but it's also it's a victory after sorrow but it's when you take a new approach and maybe taking that new approach is not moving forward with something you know that three of wands reverse it's like don't focus on the past, just move forward. You need to move forward. I feel like you're really focusing on something that you need to let go, you need to move on from. The Three of Wands is about moving on, but it's reversed. I feel like you're restricting yourself, wanting to, I don't know if you want to prove something with that Six of Wands. That's a fighter. Okay, this is definitely a fighter. And it's interesting because it says, do not back down from opposition. So show strength and fortitude. There's discord among friends or family. I feel like you are definitely in fight mode. Definitely in fight mode. Has to do with your family or your friends. Something is going south. It's it's there's no uh, there's wasted time, there's lack of foresight. I feel like you are learning some sort of a lesson with the world card, which is in the past. This is a, a lesson that is being learned. We have a cycle that is ending in your life. This is like 
uh, I feel like you're about to step into new territory, you know, with that world card and that ace of swords. That's a, they're both new beginnings cards. They really are. So you do have a new beginning here when something comes out. There's some sort of truth that is coming out. I feel like, it, I don't know if it has to do with a business or it has to do with a home or it has to do with a family situation. I feel like it does have to do with a family. There's truth coming out. But I feel like this battle, whatever the battle is, it's all coming to an end. It is, because that's what the Six of Wands is. It's like the, it's like the, uh flag you know it's victory after sorrow it's like the end so there is a battle that is ending it's all coming to an end you need it feels like you're not receiving a lot of re support from others with the three of wands reverse that's a lack of support that's a that's not getting what you thought you were going to get Somebody's not getting enough support. Or they're not getting very much. Yeah, not. But this is, again, stand your ground. You may be feeling like you're being attacked. You're going to probably be put under attack. Some of you are dealing with a fire sign, another fire sign. This could be an Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, sun, moon, or rising. We have a lot of fire energy here. We also have Gemini, we also have Taurus. There is somebody, uh, the outcome is the Knight of Wands reversed. That is, uh, out of control, angry. I feel like there's somebody here that is angry. I feel like there's aggressive behavior. Very, 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 very aggressive. I feel like you're dealing with somebody that is very boastful. This is somebody that is loud. This is, this is, um, there could be a sudden departure here. This is somebody that doesn't want responsibility, doesn't want to be held accountable, that runs their mouth. You're dealing with somebody that runs their mouth a lot and I feel like you're being, you're being put in a very tough position. People may be asking you a lot of questions, you know, and there's some sort of embarrassment here with that hero font reversed. You're dealing with somebody that is an ignorant uh, know-it-all. I feel like this person is, I don't know if they're, I feel like they're younger. I feel like they're younger than you, but we do have this older woman here. There is an older woman here that is not supporting you. She is part of the problem. This woman is part of the problem. I don't know if you're in a commitment with this woman or if it's a, a family member. It's an older woman. You need to let go. You need to let go. The suggested, suggested, you know, thing for you to do. The advice is the four of pentacles reverse. That's let go. Let go. Let go. Let go. Let go. Let go. Just let it go. Release it. You know, it's time to relax. Let go. Let go. You need to let go. Don't do anything. Underneath it is the magician reverse. Don't do anything. You you need, and I feel like you're dealing with somebody that is violent. They're out of control. They may be approaching you. This person may want to win at all costs. I do feel like you're going to be put in a very tough position. I feel like it is a family member. This person is extremely aggressive. They're angry. They're upset. They need attention. You're dealing with somebody that needs some attention. I feel like it's another fire sign, if you ask me. It feels like there's a violence here and you need to protect yourself. I feel like you need to protect yourself. You're gonna be put in a position. This is defend yourself, protect yourself. You're gonna be challenged. You're gonna be caught off guard. 
and it's not over yet okay you may think it's not over yet get prepared to battle I do because I saw that at the beginning you're gonna be put up again you're gonna be somebody is ready to fight they want to fight and it could just be a verbal battle but it could also be a physical battle with all these wands okay um, you are protected though there's some sort of angel protection here you're being guided to let something go but I feel like you're not listening there's a lack of spirituality here with the Hierophant card there's a lack of listening to the gut I feel like you have an opportunity to go in a different direction but you there's fear of commitment or there's fear of opening up it's like you're you're restricting yourself you're restricting yourself for some reason I feel like you you need to uh, take some sort of action that you haven't been taking because the magician is reversed it's like you're not doing anything and it's interesting so I said don't do anything don't do anything with this family member that is fighting with you but it's, but then again I got you you need to protect yourself but I feel like you need to let go you need to let go uh, maybe you're I don't know if somebody's holding a grudge it's really hard when you're being put in a position and they want to fight with you. You have to protect yourself. You're forced to pro you're forced to protect yourself. Somebody's forcing you. They're forcing you to fight. They're forcing you to protect yourself. And it feels like you just want peace, right? You just want peace, but this this person won't stop. They won't. This person they won't stop. I also feel like we have a relationship that is no longer on the same page with the Hierophant reversed. You could be dealing with somebody that is, I mean, the Knight of Wands reversed, that's like a one night stand or somebody that sleeps around that has no staying power. There could be a sudden departure here. Somebody may be being released from a commitment that's unplanned. With a Magician Reverse, we may have an unplanned departure. The Magician Reverse mirroring the Knight of Wands Reverse. That could be an unplanned departure. Feels like we have somebody here that's been living in hell. And they've been holding on for financial reasons or because it was stable, because it was secure. But there's a battle that is about to end with the Six of Wands. That's right in your future. Okay, in the near future. So there's a battle or a conflict that is coming to an end. It is. It is. But you know, that's the victory after sorrow wreath. Okay, so there's sorrow that comes along with this victory. Okay, you have to fight some sort of battle. So I feel, and there is a battle here. There definitely is. But the battle is coming to an end. Somebody's leaving. They could be leaving very, very suddenly. It feels like there could be some public embarrassment too. And I don't know where that's coming from. Anyhow. There's some sort of information or truth that is going to come out. Or you may just be taking a new approach. You may just be like, you know what, I'm all done. I'm all done fighting because that is it. This is like, I'm done. This is, this is somebody that is very confident, that is finding, it's over. It's over. Like the battle is over. It's over. So some, some, some freaking battle is ending. It is. But before it ends, it's going to be rough. Is, I don't know if it's fighting over money or something like that. This is like a family situation. Yeah, it has to do with money. Ace of Swords, taking a new approach. Something is going downhill. It's going down. I feel like it's going downhill fast. Maybe the business is going downhill fast. Or the money is going downhill fast. Or I don't know if this has to do with uh, family money or inheritance or business money or 
something. There's something because the Ace of Wands is reversed on, on top of that Ten of Pentacles. That's like the money going downhill fast. Something or somebody's stability is going downhill fast. There's been a lack of, of foresight. Something is not well re received. There's there's no support. There's a there, somebody needs to stop fighting. But I feel like you're being forced to fight. So that's really. I mean that's what I got here. I got that somebody is being forced to fight. You're dealing with a very cocky, ignorant individual. This person is reckless, acts inappropriately. It's like they're crazy. I hate to say that, but it's what it looks like. Boastful, show off, obnoxious. This person's obnoxious. Pathological liar. Mentally ill. Magician reverse. This person has a mental imbalance. They need constant attention. And they're under a lot of social pressure right now. Maybe they've gotten out of a marriage or they're being neglected or, they're be, or they've been rejected. You know, the hair front reverse, it's about marriage. So I don't know what's going on here. This is like no commitment, lack of, you know, unhappy about a breakup or a separation or something like that. Or this person just might be uh, unstable, you know, totally unstable with even with four pentacles reversed. You're dealing with somebody that is unstable. And they can't do the right thing because it's like the social pressure. It's almost like they want to prove to society that they are someone that they are not. And by taking you down from your position, that's what this is. This is like, I'm going to take you out of your position. So yet somebody wants to take you down with them, perhaps. That's what it looks like to me. But you do have an older woman here that is part of the problem. Okay? So maybe you need to reevaluate who this older woman is. There is some good fortune that is coming your way. Thank God. Six of Wands is victory after sorrow. It's the end of a battle. Congratulations. This conflict is going to end, but before it ends, there is going to be discord. Acting impulsively, acting without thinking. There's somebody here. It feels like I've done this reading before for you. This is like deja vu. It does. It feels like somebody, it does. It feels like I've, I've said all this, which is weird. So anyway, it feels uh, like somebody is going to be uh, very aggressive, very aggressive. It feels like they are going to put you on the spot. This is a pathological liar. And I feel like you're going to be feeling upset over the whole scenario I mean the knight of wands that's the outcome knight of wands reverse that's upset somebody may be moving really 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 fast with the knight of wands reversed speeding that's a departure of some sort somebody is leaving fast unplanned I feel like we are dealing with somebody that is violent. They may be opening up, you know, just opening up the floodgates. This person is freaking out. <laughs> Who is this person? It may have something to do with money. My stomach, I do apologize. My stomach is... Makes all kinds of noises. Anyhow, um, no, no, with the magician reversed. That's, that's no, 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 no success. 
trying to stop you. Somebody is trying to stop you. They're trying to stop you from being successful. You have a troublemaker here, just so you know. You got a troublemaker here that is really going to pick a fight with you. And you are going to need to defend yourself. They are going to take a new approach. This, this person is going to take a new approach. And you're going to have to take a new approach. Oh my God. Ooh. There's also somebody here that has commitment issues. And maybe they're going to they're going to get released, you know, they're going to there's no commitment. They they won't commit, they won't commit. And you know, it feels like they could be having, I don't know if there's some sort of sex situation going on here. They don't they they, they don't see, they don't see something. Um There is commitment issues here. We got somebody here that has commitment issues. They may be afraid to commit. Letting go, no commitment. Star reverse. Why is this happening? No faith. Disbelief. There is disbelief here. Why is this happening? No help. Unwilling. No hope. There's no hope. Star card reverse. This is not what I asked for. we have somebody here that is depressed they're going through a period of depression this is somebody that is depressed this is also somebody that is not very spiritual we have somebody here that lacks spirituality they're, they're they don't believe they don't believe they don't have faith they don't they don't believe in a higher power this person is i don't know this person's leaving they're leaving a commitment or something that's another whole story you got somebody here that doesn't want commitment. They don't believe in commitment. They want to, I don't know, Knight of Wands reverse. That's some, the Knight of Wands upright or reverse. That's like somebody that doesn't want responsibility. That is very uh, fly by the seat of their pants, you know, has a hard time keeping it in their pants. Male or female, you know what I'm saying? In other words. Um, no staying power whatsoever. Somebody's leaving and they could be leaving extremely sudden, suddenly. Why is this happening? Your faith is going to be tested. Your faith is going to be tested. You've got somebody here that is doing something extremely spontaneous. And it's going to end whatever battle this is that you've been battling. And you're going to be put in a tough position. Now we got the King of Swords on the bottom. It could be dealing with Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, but this is somebody that is delivering information. Okay, there's gonna be a conversation. It's gonna be challenging. You're gonna, and this could even have to do with a law official. It could be a law official, somebody from the court, somebody from the, you know, defender's office or the police station or something like that. This could, could be anybody. But you are going to be receiving some information from somebody that is very truthful. Okay, it's the truth. It is what it is. Accept it. Okay, it's going to be harsh. Harsh. Okay. Um, you're also going to have to make a decision. It's, I feel like you're going to be put in a position where you have to make a decision. Do you want to fight or do you want to walk away?